Peter Siddle signing autographs as well he should. 221 test wickets Australia shortly to resume on day four at four for 137. A lot of people want to know what happens behind the scenes at Fox Cricket so we thought we'd take you a bit of a tour. We're in the media area at the moment so there's probably at a test series like this 50 or 60 accredited media. The India and England series normally about 100 so there's a lot of radio coverage as well. We walked into one of the boxes here. Here's the main man uh, from Fox. You better not interrupt him. Jared Waitley. Brought, there he is, the G-man. He's doing a bit of radio here at the moment. Obviously does a fine, fine job on uh, on Cricket 360. We'll come out this way. Simon O'Donnell dominated yesterday. Dominated yesterday on the lunch show. Uh, we'll take you through this way because this is, uh, well, actually we might just peek in here. This is uh, wardrobe and makeup down here. So this is Anna ironing away, uh, trying to make everyone look good. Lauren, and just very quietly, always working. Skull, the great Kerry O'Keefe is working on his notes. How are you? Good morning, Howie. He's Good ready morning, to go. Everybody. Always down there. We might sneak out this way, though, and we'll take you to what essentially is the hub of the entire Fox Cricket operation. So this is sort of the back blocks of the MCG in the media area. A lot of our former VFL footballers up here. On this side, though, the sirs in the world of cricket, Sir Donald Bradman, Sir Richard Hadley, Sir Garfield Sobers. Michael Vaughan, come on. Vaughan, he's got to get in the commentary. We're not too far away from the start of play. Uh, a bit of food for the crew. Now, look, look over my shoulder. This is the most prepared man at Fox Trigger. That is Mike Hussey. So he's working on a lab at the moment. So you see the lab. These are actually the four guys running the lab. There's uh, Slats, one of our directors. So you can't really see, but up the top here, there's, there's about 400 little sensors and it all works with infrared light. So it's pretty technical what Huss is doing. I think he's working on something on James Pattinson at the moment. So if we cut Hinksy to what people would see at home. So that's what you see in the lab. Where's James Pattinson? There he is. There's Jimmy Pattinson. So he's working on something. Go on, Huss, give us yeah, your best. James Pattinson was on fire in the first innings and uh, this Melbourneian crowd's going to be right behind him. Howie, how are you going? <laughs> Trying to work on something. <laughs> um, you don't let anyone else in here. I'm honoured. You love the lab. We don't get you out of here. It's great fun in the lab, mate. These guys behind the scenes do an amazing job. Uh, the, the, the graphics and all the uh, technology they use is incredible. This man's incredible. Known these days as Tony Barber. That's how slick that man is in the, in the lab. So, as I said, the, these guys running the lab. This is called a jib camera, so it's all weighted up. So, again, Hinksy can take the shot and you You'll see how it's all smooth and in motion. So that's a very, very expensive piece of kit there. Um, we'll come around this way. These are the, uh, well, these are the turkeys that run the show. Uh, over here, this is where everyone gets ready. There's the great Isha Gua, who always seems to come out here, paid by an Australian broadcaster, always going for the opposition. Last year, went for India. You're on the Kiwis today, aren't you? Maybe. You are. He's doing the super coach. Adam Gilchrist, <laughs> always professional. So many cameras at a ground like this. So uh, Frankie Boy over there. So that's the main camera. Hinks, he can cut. So there's Frankie. We'll cut to Frankie's camera. So that's the main uh, shot you see. Then in the middle, there's Stevie Boy, um, who does the super slow. And then on the outside, here's the G-man. So after we cut from Frank to G, we'll follow the ball. So that's if it's whipped away through mid-wicket. Uh, here's Paddy Boy in here, who uh, works for Crick Viz. They do all the stats. This information actually every ball is collated back in Leeds actually back in Leeds in the UK it comes to the system we get it here here's the general manager of cricket Matty Weiss just come here and we'll show you here's Buzzard who runs the whole show so this is how we get spoken to in commentary you've got Vaughan you've got Shane Warren, you've got Isha down the bottom not sure what's happened with our man that runs tapes he's listed there as stinky so he probably needs to do something about that we wander around here here's uh, Alex the scorer and the world's greatest statistician over 200 big bash games uh, 60 70 test matches. Loz, how are you today? I'm very well, Howie. Good to see you. Um, and Loz does everything. This is a man, so Loz actually does it all by hand and then he speaks in our ear, gives us all the information. We'll just slide into commentary now. Now, look who you've got uh, opening the batting today. You've got the great Ian Smith. You've got Michael Vaughan. I'll show you how commentary works as we walk in here. The player's coming out on the ground. So you've got a selection of buttons here. So this is the director and the producers. You can choose to turn the director down or up if you want to listen to him. He's the one giving you all the instructions. So I'll whack these on. And you won't hear me until I hit the red button. At that stage, you're on. Here we go. So, welcome to day four of the test match in Melbourne between Australia and New Zealand.